The Biden administration is drastically changing the game plan over oil here in the U.S., further distancing himself from former President Trump's goal of energy independence. Upon taking office, President Biden instantly killed the Keystone Pipeline and other oil projects throughout the nation. A completely different agenda than that of the Trump administration regarding things like oil drilling, oil fields, oil wells, oil pipelines. No shock to anyone these days, there's a contentious and politicized divide over oil production. And we import it from places that have much laxer environmental, labor, human rights standards than we do. So if we produce our oil here, which we need, um, you know, we should actually be producing more of it, not less in the short term, because that actually reduces global carbon emissions. And that's what we should all agree is important. Reducing carbon emissions is an, is an incredibly important goal. And I think it's one that's shared, especially in California, by policymakers on both sides of the aisle. What's important, though, is recognizing that in the short term, it's just not economical for renewables to completely replace oil and gas. Oil independence is an incredibly important goal for the United States. When we import oil, we're importing it from places like Russia, like Saudi Arabia, places that don't have even a smattering of the safety, labor, human rights, or environmental standards that we do. So we're actually exacerbating the carbon emissions problem when we import oil. And don't forget, we're also having to bring that oil over either via pipeline or via ship, which also carries you know, inherent potential issues as well. So domestic production and energy independence is a really important goal, both from an economic, but also a national security point of view.